For many of us, a black or a navy blue blazer is a wardrobe staple, but a red blazer can be just as valuable in a capsule wardrobe. The Duchess of Cambridge wore one just recently on a trip to Copenhagen, and she's worn it quite a few times over the past few years, proving that a red blazer can be a really valuable, hard-working piece in your wardrobe. Maybe you've got one in your wardrobe that you've forgotten about that you can start wearing again, or maybe you're even thinking about buying one. I thought in today's video I'd show you loads of gorgeous ways that a red blazer can be worn. So let's start off with the outfit that inspired this video. Now this is a very smart look but you could use the same colour scheme with the red blazer and just dress it down a little bit. For a more casual look you could wear a t-shirt with some wide leg trousers and some white sneakers. It's still a very smart look but with a casual feel to it. It's a really inexpensive outfit to pull together but can look great. Instead of wide leg trousers, which not everyone is a fan of, black denim is another option in whatever style and just add a white camisole to that. It's another easy to pull together outfit that works effortlessly. The outfit the Duchess of Cambridge is wearing is with a frilly shirt from me and M, I believe. I'll link it below for you. And her bag is from Aspinall of London. Their bags are absolutely beautiful, but they are expensive. This one is called the Mayfair bag. Now I put the look together with what I have. Everything I'm wearing is things that I already had in my wardrobe. So I could show you how easy it is to put together a similar look without spending lots of money. My coat and trousers are both from Zara. My shirt is from Lily Silk. I don't have a frilly one, so I just adapted the look with what I had. The shoes are from Ali Shoes. Now these do have a more stiletto heel than what Kate Middleton's wearing, but work absolutely fine. And then I added my trusted Teddy Blake bag. This is such a classic shape, so it tends to work beautifully with everything. It's not an identical look, and this is obviously a coat, not a blazer, but the simplicity of the outfit means it can be recreated with what you have. Another lovely way to wear a red blazer is with the colour combination of red, white and blue. There's lots of ways that this could be mixed around with things that you may already have with different style tops and different colour blues. But that combination can be mixed around lots of different ways. You could try a white shirt or a v-neck t-shirt or a camisole top. You could wear it with or without a belt. Wear a different coloured bag with it, maybe black or tan or add some blue to it with a blue bag and shoes. And you could add some leopard print, maybe a scarf, some belt or some shoes. I tried it with two different shades and styles of denim jeans. These both come from H&M. It's really down to preference and what you've got already in your wardrobe. I put it together with a very simple white t-shirt, but I'll try it with a white button down shirt as well. This blazer is from New Look. It's a great price and actually it's quite a nice fit too. The gold buttons really complement a red blazer. If you do have a red blazer that maybe you've had for a while and could do with a little bit of an upgrade, just swap the buttons for some gold ones like these from Etsy. They're not expensive and it's a very quick way to refresh a blazer. Camel and red go beautifully together and a lovely way to wear it is with black bottoms, camel top and a red blazer. This outfit is with a red coat but this would work just as well with a blazer and with a camel top. I've tried it with a with Zara single button blazer and a camel top which was from phase 8 and some black bottoms. The only trouble with camel tops is that they can look a little bit like you've got nothing on underneath. But regardless, I do think it's a nice colour combination. Now, rather than black jeans, you could do a similar look with blue jeans and a red bag. Or instead of jeans, a smarter pair of camel or beige trousers could be another nice option. Last week I showed you a blue and white striped shirt from H&M. If you've got a similar one, you, you could try a look like this. The red blazer works really well with it. You can see how these pieces look terrific together. And a blue and white shirt is such a lovely piece to have in your wardrobe, especially in the springtime, when you can create so many outfits with it. I've tried this very look with my things. These are H&M jeans and shirt, and with the red new look blazer. The stripe on this shirt is very subtle, but it's a nice alternative to a white shirt. I could add a lovely white bag to the outfit, like the picture, and I think it would complete the outfit beautifully. 
If you like stripes, another lovely way to wear the red blazer is with the horizontal stripe and it looks great with white jeans. If you have a white top with a black or a blue stripe, add it to white jeans and pair it with a red blazer and a red bag for a very clean but classy look. A similar look could be done with blue jeans and maybe add a blue or a black bag instead. You could try a layered look, very stylized outfit. Just layer a denim shirt underneath and add a neck scarf. It looks great and it's another way to wear it. I tried a striped top with black jeans and my top is a black and white striped top. And I've put that together with some white trainers for a more casual look. I've put it together with my Teddy Blake structured bag, but I think a crossbody bag would look nice too. If you don't like stripes, you could always try polka dots. They do look nice with the red blazer and jeans. And again, it's another option. The red blazer can be worn. Red and black look gorgeous together and it's a very simple but classy way that you could style a red blazer. Kate Middleton has worn the red blazer with all black many times. It's a very striking looking combination but so simple. It really doesn't matter what black pieces you add to it, it just works. Making it the perfect outfit to put together with what you have. I've put it together with a black roll neck from Zara and black jeans. I would wear loafers with the look or black boots or black heels which will give me more options. It's just a great full back outfit to return to time and again if you have a red blazer in your wardrobe. Another gorgeous combination is red with red. It can be very simple to put together, but looks quite effortless, but very expensive. I've put a red blouse underneath the blazer, and luckily the reds are very similar. This is the blouse from Lily Silk. It's in a classic cut, but instead of the red blouse, I could try a red t-shirt, or any kind of style of red top would also look nice. Anything red really with any kind of black bottom you have. A wide leg trouser would be gorgeous or a straight leg pant. And of course flats would work with it too. I tried layering it one step further with a camel coat and these colours are just gorgeous together.